Welcome, you filthy heretics, to the first episode of Skulls for the Skull Throne. My name is Blake. So, I love the Warhammer universe, both fantasy and 40k. Uh, so I wanted to create a video series where I'm going to show off the many different Warhammer games. Uh, some will be full playthroughs, some will be just single episodes. Uh, and I thought why not start with one of the best ones and one of my favorites, Space Marine. This game came out in 2011 for PS3, 360, and PC. Uh, I played it when it first came out, I beat it twice, and I played through a, uh, a bunch of the multiplayer when people still played it. Um, if you're unfamiliar with this game, it's a third person shooter very similar to Gears of War, but I like it better than Gears of War. Um, which is fitting, since Gears of War ripped off so much shit from Warhammer 40k. But hey, who hasn't at this point? But hey, I hate doing intros, so let's just dive into the game. In the grim darkness of the far future, there is only war. That's, that never stops being awesome no matter how many times I read it. Greya. So yeah, this is one of the few games where you actually play as the Ultramarines instead of the Blood Ravens. Uh, but I was looking up some stuff about this game on Wikipedia and I have no idea if this is canon. I don't, it doesn't matter, it's a great game. Uh, boy, I, you gotta love that shitty, shitty, like, future, pa like, past future tech, like, goddamn, guys, come on, you got power armor, make a better UI. It's fine. It's for the Emperor. Xenos Invasion in Progress, Re recommended course of action. Exterminatus, well, that's a bit extreme. Extra dips again. So they don't want to blow up the uh, planet because there's titans here. Delay unacceptable. Loss of strategic asset, the titan. Okay. But, hey, that's really hard to read when you zoom in like that, guys. Adeptes Astartes Ultra. Response incoming. This game has one of the fucking coolest openings. Minus, the, minus this text that's a little bit too zoomed in. Here we go. Hope I turned subtitles on. I think I did. Oh, THQ, rest in peace. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, this was made by Relic Games. They made, you know, most of the good Warhammer games. Like Dawn of War 1 and 2. And 1 and 2. You know what, that's not fair. I haven't even played 3 because I would probably be disappointed. Secure the Titans. Only the most badass Space Marines don't wear helmets. But come on, man, there's bullet fire everywhere. Bolter fire, sorry, sorry. And they have taken the planetary defense weapons. Clever of the damn dogs. Keeps us off their backs while they loot the Titan war machines. Brace for evasive maneuvers. Pilot, report. Startled engine is dead, Sergeant. We are losing altitude. Get the ship to safety. We find another way down. Hi, Captain. Found the whole class of Joe for returning to launch bay. Put, put on your helmet, you god to the surf, damn it! The gun battery. What do you want to go home already, Sergeant? Not before having a word or two with the orbs. Is that why? Can they get him a robot eye? The Codex Astartes does not support this action. Try to keep up. Let's fucking go! I'm having flashbacks to MDK. Fucking green skins. Bam! 
fucking game established. Oh man, I forgot I don't start with a chainsword. So yeah, you run around and you shoot uh, orcs. Oh, I have, fuck, I only have a pistol too. God, I need to remember how to play. It's been like a few years. Yeah, one thing though you'll <coughs> immediately see that's different from Gears of War is the melee is much better, in my opinion. Camera, com camera can have the camera can give you some problems, but god damn it, god damn it, go on face. Boy, I need some better guns. Okay, so, so obviously we're killing orcs. Uh, where am I going? Oh, shoot the red barrels. Fuck, that's cool. Whoa. Right, well, let's go this way. Triangle to stun, and then oh yeah, I forgot about God, I forgot all about that. Yeah, that's how you uh, regain health. Get a nice little execution, which is super fitting. It's fucking... I mean, it's Warhammer, dude. It's... It's supposed to be metal. Yep. Yep. Oh. Fuck you, buddy. Ain't your buddy, orc. Also, before someone points it out, yeah, I know the series is called Skulls for the Skull Throne, and I'm playing as I'm playing as a Space Marine. But like, to be fair, in most of the Warhammer 40k games, you play Space Marines. They're kind of the default class. Yeah. Boy, I would really love some fucking health. Come here, I need your I need to kill you and get you. Give me health. Oh, that's a good one. Boy, I hate this fucking knife. Okay, where are the where are we at? Where are we at? All right. I will say, for being this basically just being a tutorial level, it's a good fucking tutorial level. Just jump right in and start hacking works up. I'm really sad this game never got a sequel. And I don't count a turtle per se. That game's disappointing to say the least. Come on. Nades. Oh. A kingdom for a bolter. Come on. You know, I don't need the health, but I like the animation. Also, game has just fucking... Oh, okay, what are we doing here? Game has some sick-ass uh, execution animations. How strong is the Space Marine? They're this strong. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I would say that ship's pretty fucking disabled. Going down. Star Killer's down there trying to trying to hold it back with the force. Oh wait, wrong wrong sci-fi series. Fucking orcs. I, I hate orcs in all types of fantasy. And I don't even know if that's like Is that racist? I mean, they're not a real race, it's fantasy or sci-fi. Whatever. Orcs suck. If you like orcs, good for you. It's all about that sweet, sweet Slanesh, am I right? How is your head fine, man? Yeah! That's a fucking sick intro. Alright, now, can I get a real bolter? Can I get a gun? A real gun? Captain Titus, come in. Damned orc shot me off course. I've had no word from Leandros. But I'm picking up box chatter from Imperial Guard for forces on the ground. Yep, okay, that's how you, yep, that's how you pause the game. Much less still fighting. 
Heading towards the front lines now. I will meet you there. Blah. Right. So this game, although it's awesome and I love it, is far from perfect. Uh, and I'm going to complain about something right now. Um, the running animation. This, the animation itself is fine, but notice how the camera shakes. Like, I don't know why it's like that. Maybe it's like to emphasize how heavy the power armor is or something, but boy, that drives me fucking nuts. Like, just, this would be fine if the camera didn't shake. I'm just going to walk normally, because it's not even that much faster. Rolling, rolling's not actually faster. I, you, I, we already went over this game. I know how to shoot. It's literally the first thing you do in the game. How did I miss? How did I miss all that? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Real weapons. Fuck yeah. So yeah, here we have the, uh, yep, bolt turn locked. Gotcha. So we have the, uh, Gears of War style switching between weapons. Like, a, a lot of Gears of War in this game. But I like this better than Gears of War. Not just because it's Warhammer, but also because the gameplay. I I feel the gameplay's a lot better. And there's no covering. I don't think there's any cover systems, because cause why the fuck would you need cover when you're walking around in a ton of armor? Yeah. Where are you? You know what? Fuck it, I'm running past you. Okay, woo, that was that did he just teleport? Was that cause I don't think that was supposed to happen. Whatever, keep moving. Captain! Give me a chain sword. Oh, I see you took your helmet off too. Only real real men take their helmets off. They're like Okay, come on. Come on. But I also love that they don't shy away from just unloading on you in the fucking first actual level. Explosions, grenades, I mean, what else would you expect, though, from a good Warhammer experience? The first fucking thing says there's only war. Yeah. That fucking head explosion when you get a headshot is the most satisfying fucking headshot or head pop. In, I, you know, almost in any game I can think of. I'm sure there's others. None of them are coming to mind right now. Fuck you. You're trying to bash me with your gun? Did you see the armor I'm wearing? You must have been aiming for my head. Blah. Reload, reload. There we are. Yep. Come on. Fucking die. There we are. What was your plan? The anthos. Man, dude, you're wasting ammo, man. Are you wounded? The Codex Astartes warns against using jump packs to leap blindly into enemy fire, and for good reason. Your days as a novice are behind you. Why do you still interpret the Codex so narrowly? I looked at its rules for guidance. We all do. But there are also benefits to thinking for yourself. So yeah, that's Leandros. You get the Enemy standard target. like he's the rookie, the other guy's the old the old veteran. And Leandros goes by the book as we can tell. Could you imagine being one of these fuckers and just running up to a space ring thinking you were going to do anything? Like uh, uh, what? 
But there's but there's fifty of us. Yeah. Yeah. So my chainsaw my chainsword fuck chainsaw. Chainsword will cut through all of you. Oh god, another thing that's just like gears is the slow walking while exposition's happening. Gee, I wonder if I'll start getting shot while I run in here. Hey look, is that Imperial Guard? Well it was. Like I said, it's been a minute. I remember the most of the beats of this game, but Whoa! Okay, but there's gonna be some parts I'm just flat out gonna forget. Whoa. Oh, I don't have any grenades. Damn it! Grenades would be really helpful right now. Can I just jump down here? Yeah, fuck it. Fuck it, just run right at them. While shooting, of course. Oh man, fucking poor... I, you know what? Like, I've thought about, like... I mean, who hasn't? Anybody that's a Warhammer fan been like, What would I be if I was in the Warhammer universe? The answer for almost all of us is Imperial Guard. And that sucks. Unless you get to choose to be a different race. But if you're listening to this, I'm assuming you're human. Or someone's cat. Or dog. My lord. You have saved us. Rise, guardsmen. You saved yourselves. We thought you did. We would be, my lord. If not for the lieutenant. Where will we find this lieutenant? At the front lines. Follow the trench network to the Lieutenant's command bunker. Carry on, Guardsman. We rendezvous with Sedonus, then we find this Lieutenant. We need updated intel on the gun battery. But hey, man, the Imperial Guard, they Get serve their the purpose. And continue through the plaza. The bunker is beyond Meat shields, usually. Can I get a chainsword? A few hundred against a million orcs. Do they fight on? Only no. in death. Get off! My legs. I can't feel my legs. I got to see a space marine. Right, so. Things, uh. Things could be better in here. You know what? This is pretty standard, I guess, though, for this universe. Like, that's. That's. That's a Tuesday. All right, so I'm in position at a broken monument near the guard lines. Hey, that looks like a broken monument. Do you have a chainsword, Sedonis? I could take off of you. Hey, is that a chainsword? Fuck! I wish that was. A, I hope that's a chainsword. found something to keep you busy. Worry not, Captain. I've saved some orcs for you. The orcs have got that gun well defended, no mistake. But typical orc behavior would be to dismantle or destroy the gun. And certainly not use it to keep our forces at bay. There's a strategy behind it. Their leader is no fool. This day is getting interesting. I may have encountered the orc during our jump to the surface. That was the orc ship I saw crash near here. Yep, that's great. Chainsword. Fuck yes. Goodbye, shitty knife. Hello, badass chainsword. Just look at it. Fuck, cut everything. Come here. Come here. Oh, that's that's so satisfying. Give me somebody to do a fucking execution on you. Oh, mm, that's, oh, that's good stuff. Oh, son of a bitch, that's cool. Oh, fuck, that's cool. It's fucking all these years later, this game's still fucking awesome. Why didn't this get a fucking sequel? Oh yeah, THQ went under and they probably didn't sell so well. Why isn't Eternal Crusade better? You come here. Oh yeah. That's the good stuff. 
Oh, that camera shake. Ugh. It's fucking irritating. I know I'm gonna, like, I keep harping on why the fuck don't you put your fucking helmets on in the middle of a war zone? Every time, uh, every time I fucking see that in any media, I just think of that scene from Starship Troopers where the dude takes his helmet off and just gets popped right in the face in, like, fucking basic training. Target that squid! Oh, great, squibs. Great. Running mines. Awesome. And I know the reason that they don't have the helmets on is because if they had helmets on, they would just be faceless grunts that wouldn't be characters. But I find it really hard to get attached to any character in the Warhammer 40k universe because they almost all die. Unless they're like a Primarch or something. Oh shit. Oh fuck. What? What the fuck was that? Whoa! Blah, it's saved. That ain't happened in a while. Of course, it's been a while since I played a fucking PS3 game. Where that? Over this side? You know, I can just do this. Ah, fuck you. How many grenades do I have? Four? Oh, yeah. Let's go nuts with it. Yeah, I don't want to waste those. Yeah, I got three more. Don't waste them. Ammo, though. Give me, ooh, give me that ammo. Fucking Leon! What? Ah, get out of my way, dude! I forget your name. Le Leonidas? No, that's 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 from 300. Oh, that's some good. That's some good Warhammer right there. Oh, yeah. Blood for the blood god! Oh shit! I better not say that too loud around these guys. Why can't I get a game where I just play as chaos? Like a shooting game where I play as chaos. All right, chainsaw time. Good thing about the pistols in this game, though, you get unlimited ammo. Drop shipping coming. Speaking of ammo, are we out? Looks like we're out of ammo. Son of a bitch. Reload. Come on. Okay, grenades. Now yeah, seems like a good time for grenades. Not you. You! Oh, fuck, he's dead. I can't stun him. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, I'm gonna have to melee you. Oh, he's stunned. He's stunned. Mash! Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's the blood for the blood god. Yeah, that's the spot. Space Marines, thank you. We thought we were done for. Where is your commander, Guardsman? Are we good? Inside, but the door is sealed. Are we good? Also, all that blood for the blood god stuff, guys. I was just, I was just kidding. Are you not with the Inquisition? Are you? Are you, Mister Mister By the Book? You know, sometimes, sometimes you gotta bend the rules. Sometimes you gotta bend the rules and, you know, worship corn. It's fine. Victory demands your sacrifice.